Hello, this is Osamu Wakabayashi from Zen Ideas. Today I want to show you uh, how to put color label like this uh, on the category uh, using Jet Engine. So I created this event management uh, kind of small project here and uh, I have to put the category. Uh, that's pretty easy and also it's really easy to add kind of background color uh, based on different categories. Like when you click read more and here as well so I put the category and with the same green color created a custom post type it's called events uh, if you haven't you have to hit the add a new so I'm gonna just go edit and show you what's inside here so I got those meta field here um, I have to create so that's the event so I have to uh, create the event category so which is uh, taxonomies. Now I have taxonomy here, so it's called event category. So let's take a look inside here. Hit the edit, and then uh, here's a name here and which post type. It's event, so you can just pick from here. And once you create a custom post type, you should should see on this list. So in my case, I picked event. Now. On here you see the meta field so you have to add a new so which I added here I called it its color and here um, you see the field type is you can pick actually color picker and then just hit um, uh, update now let's go to events this is the custom post type and here I created event categories uh, taxonomy here and then here I have three different categories business event, community event, special event. So, for example, I can pick uh, edit. And you see that color uh, picker here. So, for the business events, I can pick this orange color. Again, so you can just pick any colors. And the same as others too. But community event, that's blue. And then orange is a business event. And you can keep adding it and pick different colors if you want to. Now let's go to listing. Okay, so I have event grid listing here. Uh, let's uh, click edit with Elementor. So let's take a quick look here. So this, uh, I says special event. So that is, I'm using dynamic terms. And then, so you can select which terms. So I'm definitely, this is event categories, right? and then go to style and then go to label uh, to the background type and here I can show you now if you just uh, use a regular background color so this is just a static color right you, if you pick so go to color and you see dynamic tags and then uh, pick this term field and then which taxonomy it's gonna be event categories and which field uh, gonna be meta field that I created and the meta field type um, that was uh, just hang on I uh, just want to make sure jet engine taxonomy and the event ca categories and then uh, here uh, the name ID is color that's right and then you can probably type that color here now you see the color here and I hit update and then so it will look like that now um, okay so let's uh, let's just add another event here add a new event and then so let's just use a kind of fake text just uh, quickly yeah I'm gonna just pause my video here just put the dummy content here and then but the thing is here, so I'm going to pick uh, this business event and then publish and then go to uh, this uh, home page. So I don't have any business event. So let's, um, here we go. So the orange color. All right. So the special event is green and I think community event is blue. And you can actually use the same tag here. Uh, so you can just copy from the previous one and paste onto this. So it should work as well.
Here's just a quick tip I just wanted to share with you guys. So hope this helps and I'll see you next time.